quite a day for 18-year-old Malcolm Goodman, who here at Burnden Park faces first division opposition in his first FA Cup tie for Halifax Town. Goodman replaces the suspended Dave Harris at centre-half. But for Peter Burke, the suspension that kept him out of the triumph over Manchester City is over, and he returns to the Halifax attack. Otherwise, it's the same Halifax side which performed so heroically in the third round, and Bob Mountford drops down to substitute. 19-year-old Mike Carter wins a place in the Bolton front line in preference to Alan Gowling, who asked to be dropped. Carter, who played 18 league games for Mansfield during a spell on loan at the back end of last season. Bolton also recall David Burke at left-back in place of Peter Nicholson, but Nicholson was called back into this side this morning when Dave Clement failed a fitness test. Out two is Len Cantello, so transfer-listed Neil McNabb plays in midfield. Ian Greaves on the right, the Bolton manager, his assistant Stan Anderson on the left. For Ian Greaves, who's one of the nicest men in football, but really for him today, a critical test, a result of critical importance. George Kirby on his feet, who was relaxed when I was talking to him before the game and thoroughly enjoying the cup run that has brought the spotlight onto his side. The ground is in good condition today, softening after recent frost, but in the goal mouth to the right, the frost remains in the shadow of the stand there, and the toss-up was in fact conducted in the dressing room so that Jim McDonough, who will defend that goal in the first half, could uh, put on the appropriate footwear, which in the end is a short stud. So, referee Terry Farley from County Durham, waiting to get this fourth round FA Cup tie underway. Bolton, who have only won twice all season, once in the first division and once in the third round of the FA Cup. And they haven't won here at Burnden Park since August. And they're in the white shirts and black shorts. And the trip by Burke on Burke in the first seconds. Peter Burke, the offender. David Burke, who went down. and Reed, up back for Greaves. So Bolton score a goal that's greeted with a cheer that has more than a note of relief in it. Nicholson's cross and Halifax couldn't get it away. It was laid back by Watmore and Greaves striking it on the half volley so crisply 1-0 to Bolton. 31 minutes gone. Oh, Ian Greaves, even with the prospect of victory, still not a smile. Carter, Walsh, what more? And it's just gone in. emphatic of finishes but it counts and it ends the Halifax resistance in the last minute of the match what more the scorer that will come as a great deal of relief to him and uh, the other opportunities have passed him by playing tribute to the Halifax effort and a final score at Burnden Park Bolton Wanderers 2, Halifax Town 0